all right class so uh, let us start with the basics of dictionary beta what is a dictionary a dictionary is an unordered set of elements please keep noting down the main main points it is set of unordered collection of elements right why we call it unordered because the order in which you enter the elements may not be the same order in which they get displayed right like tuple list and string where indexing is there dictionary elements are not indexed but internally they are indexed via keys in dictionary we have key value pair all right and the dictionary elements they are indexed by keys they are not having index like 0 and 1 all that with the help of keys they are indexed right am i audible to everyone very clearly yes please molik please again say something unmute yourself and say some uh, something beta yes or no yes sir speak again molik yes sir now beta some important points i would like to revise with respect to dictionary okay now first point is i told you dictionary is set of unordered elements right then in dictionary we have key value pairs the key of the dictionary must be immutable remember these points minutely that in dictionary the keys must be immutable the value of the key can be of any type but particularly the key of the dictionary must be immutable type that means any list cannot act as a key okay got it the next point is keys must be unique दो कीज सेम नहीं हो सकती बेटा लेकिन कीज की वैल्यू सेम हो सकती है लाइक सपोज आई एम हैविंग मार्क्स ट्वेंटी एज ट्वेंटी द वैल्यू ऑफ टू कीज कैन बी सेम बट टू कीज मस्ट बी यूनिक अगर एज नाम की की है तो अगली की एज नाम की नहीं होनी चाहिए नो टू कीज शुड बी सेम एम आई क्लियर टू एवरी raise your thumb to give the feedback beta this chapter is little bit technical so all of you be alert lagan clear hai bacche uh, webhav no response coming from your side all right so no two keys should be same okay got it right so i am uh, giving one example over here i am taking dictionary name emp equal to beta every dictionary starts with curly bracket closed with curly bracket my first key e code i am taking my key of string type key value pair key value they are separated by colon first give the key then colon then value of the key this is key value pair 
बेटा दिस एंटायर एलिमेंट इज की वैल्यू पेयर ओके की वैल्यू इज सेपरेटेड बाय कोलन नाउ सेकेंड की वन की वैल्यू पेयर एंड सेकेंड की वैल्यू पेयर दे आर सेपरेटेड बाय कॉमा दे आर सेपरेटेड बाय कॉमा I am taking name over here. I am taking name Gaurav. I am taking the employee name Gaurav. Okay. Then sec third key value pair. I am taking salary. I am giving the salary figure here. Clear, ah, bache. then next key i am giving age now here i am closing the curly bracket and i have created an example of dictionary so i request everyone sitting online please note down the example in your registers because next i am going to discuss all the methods so it will be easy for you to uh, justify with each method now when i just enter the dictionary name beta all of you go through the minute concept of this of this chapter when i am entering only the name of dictionary it will display the entire structure of dictionary <laughs> am i clear to everyone vanshika jatin manreet now if i particularly want to check any value of any key then in the square bracket you pass that key whose value you want to check is lcd clear to you both you can come over here one can come here one can come here now it is clear view is clear beta so whenever you want to check value of any particular key that key you pass as a parameter inside the square bracket this will give you the value of that particular key got it am i clear to all yes any doubt to any child all right now i am going to start the methods of dictionary so all of you please view it carefully and if you have any doubt you can raise your hand my first method is length method denoted by l e n now the length method of dictionary will count the total number of key value pairs now right now in front of you i have created an employee dictionary and total key value pairs are 4 so the length displayed will be 4 am i clear to you both online class am i clear to all all right now next method is get method when we use the get method it will display the value of the key okay like i am giving here emp dot get 
in bracket i am passing e code check it out the get method of dictionary is used to display the value of the key that you pass as a parameter but suppose you are passing such a key which does not exist in your dictionary python will raise error emp dot get i am entering the key department okay nothing is coming because this key does not exist in your dictionary am i clear so the key whose value you want to find using get method must exist in the dictionary am i clear now i am giving salary salary key exist in my dictionary and the value print is 12000 am i clear now next method is two methods we have discussed length and get now the next method is items method now this method will display all the items present in the dictionary by items i mean key value pairs by item i mean key value pairs okay but for using this method you have to use the for loop right am i clear to all clear like suppose if i am having this dictionary and i am giving items method here see here in the form of tuple all the key value pairs are displayed in form of tuples right carefully see beta the key value pairs are enclosed inside the round brackets and they are appearing in form of tuple am i clear then next method i have is keys method by name it is very much clear what keys method will do keys method will return all the keys in the dictionary like emp dot keys function check it out in the form of list all the key names are available with you all the name of the keys are appearing in a sequence in the list form by keys method it will display only and only the keys of the dictionary am i clear up till here to all of you any doubt any queries up till here next is values method now what values method will do it will return all the values present in the dictionary check it out compare the result of values method with the function uh, uh, with the uh, keys function in the keys function all the keys were displayed in the values function all the values of the keys are displayed
Am I clear to all? Now, next method which I'm going to discuss is your update method. Okay, what is the general meaning of update? One thing is addition. One thing is updation. Who will tell the difference? Raise your hand only. Yes. Addition means to add a new key value pair. Okay. Yes. Update means to modify or change the existing key value pair. Am I clear online class? All right. Now, now uh, there is one condition for updation method. Who will tell that condition? There is one condition for the update method. Who will tell that condition? Webhav has raised hand. Yes, Webhav, unmute yourself where you are. Unmute yourself. Sir, both should be dictionary. Pardon? Dubara bolo webhav unmute karke khud ko. Sir, both should be in dictionary form. You want to say key must already exist in the dictionary? In order to run the update method, Suppose you want to update the salary of employee. The condition is the key must already exist in the dictionary. If your key is not available, the new key with that name will get created. Okay. Like I am giving EMP. Uh, salary equal to 15,000 and now I am printing the dictionary. See here, this is updation, updation of any particular key value pair. Okay. Now let us do with update. This was the simple updation I did. This was the simple updation. Now I'm going to discuss the update method. What is the role of update method? Update method merges the key value pair from the new dictionary into the original dictionary. Please note it down all of you. The update method is used to merge the key value pair from the new dictionary into the original dictionary. Either by adding online RP note kijiye please either by adding or by replacing either by adding or by replacing suppose there is one key value pair which is available in the new dictionary but is not available in the old dictionary it will get added. And if there is same key value pair, name udar bhi hai, name udar bhi hai. So the new dictionary key value pair 
will overwrite the data in the previous dictionary am i clear to all let us do this with example i am having emp1 i am creating my dictionary okay salary equal to oh sorry not equal to 10000 then i am having age 20 okay this is my original dictionary now i have another dictionary name okay right and i am having right now go through these two dictionaries carefully which key value pair are same name and salary they are same which two are different age and department age and department now i am going to merge emp1 dot update emp2 right and print emp1 now check it out the key value pairs which were same they get overwrite but those which were totally different they get added emp1 dictionary mein emp2 dictionary ke elements merge ho gaye emp2 aur emp1 mein jo key value pair same the they get updated and if there was any key value pair which was available in emp2 but it was not in emp1 it get added it get added am i clear to all lagan vanshika jatin manreet gorav concept is clear of update method any doubt any queries up till here now next method i'm going to discuss is pop method this method you have already discussed in the list also who will tell the meaning of pop yes please particular key will get delete and its value will get returned and its value will get returned okay please note it down the pop method removes and return the pop all of you online class you also note down beta the pop method is used to remove and return the dictionary element associated with the particular key okay now suppose i am having dictionary uh, emp1 dot pop and i am giving 
department i am giving department see here the value of department was teaching and teaching value has been returned because i have removed the key with the name department i have removed the key with the name department the value of the key which you have deleted is gets displayed gets displayed okay agar to aapki key jo delete kar rahe ho wo exist karti hai to uski value return ho jayegi की रिमूव हो जाएगी पर अगर आप कोई ऐसी की रिमूव करने की कोशिश कर रहे हो दैट डज नॉट एग्जिस्ट देन पाइथन रेजिस एन एरर ओके सपोज आई एम गिविंग ई एम पी वन डॉट पॉप आई एम गिविंग ग्रेड चेक इट आउट आई ट्राई टू रिमूव one such key which does not exist in the dictionary so python raises an error and what is the name of the error key error the name of error is key error am i clear now see here अभी आपको मैंने बताया आप एक ऐसी की को रिमूव करने की कोशिश कर रहे हो जो आपकी डिक्शनरी में एग्जिस्ट नहीं करती ओके पाइथन इंडिकेट्स एंड एरर देर इज वन मोर वे आउट दैट इंस्टेड यू वॉन्ट पाइथन शुड इंडिकेट एनी एरर एनी मैसेज शुड कम और एनी वैल्यू शुड गेट प्रिंट इन केस योर अवेलेबल की is not in the dictionary so here i have given the second parameter minus 1 either you pass any numeric value either you pass any message enclosed in double quotes so if your given key does not exist in the dictionary pop method will display the value that you have given or the message that you have given not valid check it out you can see here you can come and see here the message has come okay online class am i clear yes students am i clear with the concept all right